Mike, come here. What? Come here, I need help. I need okay, I guess you don't want to test fire again. Okay, let's go. Where are we going? Range. I already have it set up. Oh, thank you, kind sir. So, what do we do? All right, we got a new classic army gun in. Looks dirty. All right, there's a spec sheet right in front of you if you want to go ahead and read that off for the people. Okay, um, Classic Army Extreme Nemesis Hex M4 Carbine, uh, Quick Change Spring 603, Programmable Electronic Control System, mm. uh, 375 to 400, and 90 day manufacturing warranty. Okay. Yep, there's a battery already in there. There should be a magazine behind the box. Uh, if you want to take a, open up that stock a little bit so it's a little bit more comfortable as well, go ahead and test fire it. Happy response. Oh. Someone didn't load the mag. Oh. There's another mag. There's another mag. Are you going full? Yeah, go for it. That's not bad. You just killed Bugs Bunny. I did kill Bugs Bunny. All right, so how do you feel about it, Mike? Um. Honestly, still a little heavy, but not enough for me to claim about it. I usually run heavy guns anyways. I mean, my guns are typically like eight, nine pounds. Um, I really like the rail up front. If they sold this separately, I probably would buy that, definitely. Um, the irons are pretty basic. Uh, I do like the, kind of like the Grim, Re uh, Grim Reaper logo on that though, that's pretty dope. And then, is this like an extended tube from compared to like the Scarab? Uh, yeah, you actually can fit a stick type battery in there. Right now we have an 11-1 wired to Dean's in there. And it does come with a Dean's uh, two small type to me adapter. And uh, you know what, I actually really do like this pistol grip too. Yeah, it's not like the, the standard A1 that gets boring after a while, but that actually feels really nice. Yep. And you got the full ambient controls too, mag release and bolt catch, ambient fire selector. It's actually really nice, man. Yep. This thing's going for 420 bucks. That's actually not bad. Yep. You know, it's comparable, I mean, trigger response wise, it's keeping up with like a Crytac and the VFCs. So, I mean, I'm, I'm actually pretty excited about this. So, pretty dope.